to the stank finger to the stank gum camp. Yeah, that's right. We're gonna do a stank finger mission. <laughs> Not stanky leg, but stanky finger. Uh, but until then, uh, I had to fast travel out here to this sniper which I'm gonna take out. Um, I didn't record myself taking down the uh, perimeters outside this oil tank. I don't want to do the oil tank camp, by the way. I just came across some snipers here and I decided to bring them down. And I managed to bring them down and the gas tank and the perimeter defenses. And I didn't show you that because I don't actually want to do this mission. Because see, there's no mission-specific territory here. I mean, I can clear out this tank. There are no project, excuse me, there are no project items in here. There are some in here, like survey crew parts. Scrap pellets I'll probably end up using later, but definitely survey crew parts I'm going to want. So I'm going to do this gut gash mission here about clearing out, dismantling one camp. But I want to do it in a camp that has another project piece in it. So that's why I'm going here. So I'll explain that. I'll explain that when I actually get there. But in the meantime, is there anything in here? Yeah, there's survey crew parts here. But I actually wanted to go to the furthest camp, so I went here. But in the meantime, I ran into some dudes, and I decided to... Ow! You know what? I decided to hide up here, because that's where they wouldn't be able to follow me in their cars. Now they've gotten out of their cars, now they're throwing crap at me. Okay. Were you afraid? You scared? Ow! Okay, screw you guys. Some of this. Ow! He's down. And you'll join him in a moment. Oops, not dead yet. Now he's down. We done? Let's take a fight with me. I'm mad, baby. And this is not gonna work. Uh, no boost. Waste of time. Oh, by the way, I have not used, I finally had to add some gas to my tank. <laughs> in my magnum opus, that like never happened before. A couple of, I think about an hour ago, I finally ran out of, I didn't run out of gas, but I finally had to consume some gas, <laughs> actually use some gas. So for the first time in like a very long time, I added gas to my tank and I dumped the fuel tank. But I added another full one, don't worry. That tells you something that I had to, I was basically able to use an entire fuel tank or an entire fuel canister without only, ha without really putting it in my car once. I was just topping off the tank from seven eighths to eight eighths, I guess. But I used three quarters of a tank apparently a while ago and I finally had to add some gas to this piece of crap. So I hope you enjoyed that. That tells you, that, that tells you something. After how many hours of this game I finally had to add gas to my own car. That says a lot. Maybe those Griffa tokens are helping too much. Okay, here we go. I'm coming for you. This part's actually pretty easy. Just look for the outline of the sniper. That will bring him down with my harpoon. Eventually. I can't see him. Is he too high? No, there he is. There we go. Okay, we got one. We got one! Okay. And he's down. I can, I can ram. No, I can't ram that one. Okay, I'll, I did not shoot him. So I don't know what happened there. Oh, the perimeter's got him. Okay, uh, one more. Ah! Darn it. Screwed that up. Isn't there another sniper up there? And down he goes. I didn't do anything. Guess I got in the way of the perimeter defenses. <laughs> Shot him down himself, huh? Okay, so those are all the snipers, right? Yeah, it looks like it. Okay, so where are the other defenses? Did I miss a sniper? This is the place I want to be, by the way. I just... Maybe I don't need to shoot the sniper. Whoop. There we go. Yeah, there we go. Well, that was taken care of. Can I shoot the... Uh... See, I can see that war crier from here. First of all, that's not the war crier. Objectives. Uh... Fighter, so 20, I have to take out 25 guys inside of here. Joy. Let's see what I can do from outside. Huh? I whittle them down. There we go. That's two. And once that recharges, I want to try that war crier up there. Actually, before I get to the war crier. 
This is fr this is free ammo, folks. Come on, it's a cooldown time. That's not so bad. Okay, you just gonna stand out there and just get picked off one at a time. Great AI, yo. I mean, I could snipe him, but I mean, come on, look. Free ammo. He's throwing crap at me. You know what? Don't even start with me. Okay, so I'm probably going to need some water. Because those snipers took me out a little bit. No, lo no loot, huh? Oh, by the way, why am I sucking these guys back with a quick draw? Because it's possible that I might be able to get some loot from these guys from where they land. One of these guys actually got stuck to my car and I grabbed some shotgun shells. I think there were sniper rounds, actually. Got him. No, I didn't get him. Let's try again. There's our war crier. Okay. Cheers, yo. Okay, so that'll help me on the ground. Uh, let's see. No loot here, huh? Lame. Okay, we're on foot then. See, I didn't have to use my sniper or anything. Oh, come on. There we go. See? Six guys out of 25 are down. Gonna be a lot of foot meets face in this video, for better or worse. Actually, I can probably come back here, but let me get my water. I don't want that kind of challenge. There might be water in here. Yeah, I might need that for an explosion. Well, let's find out in a second. Keep it handy. Yeah, I'm probably going to have to drop this to kick it in, right? Yeah, it's going to make me drop it. Annoying, but hey. It is not a sniper. Okay. There is a fence on the other side of it. Okay. Any weapons? They're not armed. Okay. Guard break. So I guess I do need a heavy punch for a guard break. Uh-oh. Yeah, see? He can grab me, though. He's not going to punch me like some people, but he will grab me. Yeah, I need a heavy punch. To hold, I have to hold down the X button to do a heavy punch to break his guard. These guys take a bit of damage, so... I gave myself a couple of Griffa token upgrades to increase my melee fighting ability with just my regular punches, but I'm probably going to need a weapon pretty soon. But the good news is that if these guys don't have weapons, they're usually not a serious risk. Some of them will dodge my punches and kicks, but they're really not a serious risk. Okay, that guy's dead. I'm not that interested in scrap, although I'm getting quite a bit in here. It's actually pretty good. So I might get 100 scrap by the time I'm done. Of course, I get way more from that, you know, just from the uh, ally camps. Here we go. I still don't know what these are for. Do they lower threat levels? I mean, I think they're just for a, for an achievement. And I, and I would never go back into a camp just to complete these. I just don't care that much. I don't see the point of it. Ooh, food. There we go. Just like, in, just like in Fury Road. <laughs> Maggots, Gila monsters. Actually, it wasn't a Gila monster, but you know. Sustenance. All protein. Okay, what's all this? Ooh, a thunder stick. Um, that's cute, but it sounds really complicated. But -na 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 -na. Actually, this is supposed to be the side route, isn't it? <laughs> the intel is supposed to lead me up here. Ha ha ha. Apparently that's a thing where, you know, if you take an alternate route, you won't have to deal with the perimeter defenses, but come on. You saw me. You saw me take down those defenses. I was perfectly fine. I didn't need a level 3 harpoon or anything. So there's another way in without having to go through the front door. But near as I can tell, I can't think of a reason not to go through the front door in a game like this. Just more more fun. Ah, crap. Can I throw the thunder stick at him? Apparently not. Okay, blokes. Yeah, I'll, funnel, I'll bring in a couple. I'll, I'll bring them to me. Boom! <laughs> I kind of wanted more than one, though. 
There we go. Uh oh, he's got one. Okay, I need the guy with the weapon first. See ya. Well, I guess I don't get the thunder stick. Here we go. <laughs> yeah, sometimes the wall helps because it stuns him a little bit. Okay, so the war cry is down, right? So I got one war cry, but not this was the side route anyway. I mean, come on. I mean, do I really need to take out the war? I don't get anything for taking out the war crier. I'm just doing it because he's there and helpless. This makes me sound kind of sociopathic, but hey, games. See? Oh, there's scrap here. Okay, so I guess I did get something for killing. <laughs> games. We don't need another hero, that's for sure. Plenty of bandits and marauders, though. So. Yeah. Okay. I don't need the food, so that's good. So I didn't have to waste it. I didn't have to waste that much water. That's great. So I get to hoard my water until I really need it. Because basically, my logic is don't drink water unless there's no food around. Yeah, that's the toilet. I was at a camp a while ago. I think it was the other camp. I forget what. It, I think it was on the east side of the map. Where the toilet was literally off of a cliff. So it was on the side of a cliff. <laughs> so I'm sure that's fun for perimeter defenses, I suppose. Uh-oh. I'll send him through the door. Come on, guys. Go. Here we go. Okay. Dumb camera. Okay. Send him one at a time through the door. Whoops. He dodged it. Okay, let's see if I can funnel him over here. Yeah, here we go. Oh! He got me. Okay, this will be interesting. The camera, the camera might be a problem, but thankfully I don't have to take on one or two at a time. Because they have to go through the door. I'm going to funnel them through this door. Stupid. At least I got some food over here. Dodge. Dodge. There we go. Come on, guys. Get at me, bro. Get at me, bro. Yeah, you want some of this? Come here. Come here, I won't hurt you. I'll just kill you. Whoops. Stupid. Just gonna stand around while I punch this guy? Okay, no, maybe he won't. And maybe the funnel isn't working so well anymore. Okay, now we get the food. Okay, that wasn't going to work. <laughs> yeah, that wasn't going to work. Oh, well. 